It was a political rally meant to popularize Deputy President William Ruto's presidency and mobilize votes from his home ground at Eldoret Sports Ground. The function was Ruto's moment of glory. Unfortunately, remarks by Meru Senator Mithika Linturi spoiled the moment. President Seya Mwashimua William Ruto is our business. Linturi made political remarks that did not go well with the majority of Kenyans. This has seen the director of public prosecution not with the concern the outcry from Kenyans, ordering for a probe into the matter. DPP Nurudin Haji directed Inspector General of the National Police Service to investigate the allegations and submit the result and investigation file in less than a week. However, the matter was not going to wait long. Detectives drawn from the Special Service Unit tracked down Linturi to Eka Hotel in Eldoret, where he had spent the night after yesterday's rally. Senator Linturi was immediately arrested and driven to Kaptembo Police Station where he was interrogated for a moment. So, to, to attend the first after the brief session with the detectives at the station, it was ordered he be transferred to Nairobi. I think part of what we are going to do is the process of investigation because I don't think they can carry in investigations without first uh, recording a statement. And I hope they will be genuine enough in disclosing the actual uh, thing that we are going to do. Linturi was now a guest of the state. <laughs> Detectives took him into their Subaru motor vehicles, exchanging them while on their way to their final destination to ensure their safety. After a six hour drive, a motorcade carrying the senator made its way into Gigiri police station under a tight security escort. <laughs> The man alighted as detectives took control of the events, giving instructions on what next. At the station, a brief statement of what had transpired was recorded, and Linturi was booked in police cells awaiting court process by NCIC come Monday. The DCI is supposed to conduct investigations and forward the file to uh, the DPP by 14th. We do not understand why then he's being arrested when uh, they're just supposed to be conducting investigations, not arrest him. Linturi faces charges of ethnic or racial contempt, contrary to Section 62 of the National Cohesion and Integration Act, which states any person who utters words intended to incite feelings of contempt, hatred, hostility, violence or discrimination against any person, group or community on the basis of ethnicity or race, commits an offense and shall be liable on conviction to a fine not exceeding one million shillings or to imprisonment for a term not exceeding five years or both. The senator has however turned down his arrest claiming his remarks were misinterpreted by his political opponents. I may have been misquoted or mean, been misunderstood, but anybody that really understands that that was a UNDI rally and what I meant was that those people that are not followers of UNDI should be rejected by the Washington issue voters. For now he will be detained at Gigiri police station as a section of leaders continue to castigate his remarks as reckless and unfortunate. The arrest of the Honorable Senator is being viewed as a political witch hunt. He's being victimized because of his stand in the political bills, uh, political party's bill, which is said to be presented to the Senate on Tuesday. We therefore think that uh, his arrest and being held in custody has everything to do with, his, with that um, bill because of his stand which is known. Meanwhile, Kenyans are reminded to peacefully coexist during this electioneering period and report any activities which are likely to threaten their security. Franklin Wala, K24 TV.